Hello, and welcome to the season of Mario. So, this is going to be on my channel, just a bunch of Mario videos, until now, towards the end of March. Why? Well, it would have been more appropriate to do this last year, since it was his 35th anniversary, but also last year was last year, so we're doing it this year. So, basically, just a bunch of Mario videos. That's just all we're going to be doing. Well, we're still going to be doing Superman, Imagine X series, Batman, Imagine X series, and regular nerdcasts. But we're going to be doing a lot more Mario stuff. More Super Mario Galaxy 2. Um, maybe some Odyssey speedruns. I've been wanting to stream new Super Mario Bros. U. A lot of stuff. And, of course, a lot of Mario Top 5s. And Grayson is not here today. He is not a big Mario person. Old, well, old man stickler, not a big Mario guy. But Fletcher is, so Fletcher's probably going to help me and be my Mario season co-star, even though I haven't even told him that we're doing this yet. But yeah, so, today we're going to be a... Oh yeah, and if you can't see, I've decked out the background with a bunch of Mario plushies and figures. So yeah. So yeah, what top five are we going to be doing today? We are going to be doing Mario games I want to see. So, uh, I've always wanted to be a person who made Mario games. It's like one of my dreams, and today I'm going to be sharing the games that I would make if I was the big man at Nintendo, getting to make Mario games and design their levels and stuff. So, let's get to it. My number five is a new New Super Mario Bros. game. I know. Everyone hates the new Super Mario Bros. series. I personally, I love it. I think it's the best 2D Mario series aside from... Yeah, I do, I do think it is the best 2D Mario series. But I do agree that it is a little repetitive and that we need a new one uh, to like spark up the formula. So my idea on how to do that is called New Super Mario Bros. Odyssey. It would be a 2D version of Mario Odyssey. Visit like similar kingdoms. You would be able to capture like things in a 2D setting. It would just be like a big, like Mario Odyssey 2D game where you, you'd like fly around the Odyssey from level to level. The, le the levels would still be like linear and pretty short, but they'd take up in like kingdoms. And at the end of every level, you'd get a moon, and you have to get like all the moons to get into the final castle, which would have like a an original boss battle or hey maybe the Koopalings. So yeah, that is. Mm. One idea, another idea, New Super Mario Bros. Galaxy, a 2D Mario Galaxy game. Uh, the Galaxy games were already very linear. Mm, sorry, so I could see this. Uh, it would be really fun, like it, like in you do in Super Mario Land 2 Golden Coins, where you like have the up level, where you're like in space with low gravity. It'd be really fun to have something like that in 2D in a Mario Galaxy New Super Mario Bros. game. Yeah, that would that would be very fun. And the final idea for New Super Mario Bros. like game is New Super Mario Bros. Sunshine. It would be very. It would be like similar to Sunshine, but you'd have like the jetpack flood. You would have him, and you'd like have to fly and skirt around the levels in a two D setting with your like jetpack, and it would be like all a deserty, beachy theme and like different locations every level you'd get like a new shine sprite and then you'd have to and there maybe there'd be a new story because in the original mario sunshine there was actually a whole story like an actually good mario story so hey maybe they do that or since it's a new super it's since it's going to be a new super mario bros game maybe they won't do any story because it's a new super mario bros game but yeah super mario i would love any i would love any 3d mario game turned into a 2d mario game Honestly, if I'd had my pick, it would be Odyssey or Sunshine. But, I mean, I, I listed three. So basically, Galaxy's the one I want least. But, yeah. Because I feel like it'd be the, I don't know, least interesting. I feel like it'd be the least unique. But, yeah. So, uh, oh crap, what was my number four? <laughs> my number four is, oh, my number four. Super Mario Maker 3. D, a 3D Super Mario Maker game where you would design big open worlds with different mission. This would be very hard for Mar like. So I have two ideas for how this could work. It would either be 
a like th a whole three D game, like make your own Mario Odyssey Kingdom, and then make a bunch, make like a super world, and package it as your own Mario three D game. That would be very hard for Nintendo to make, and I don't want to put them through that. That's what I'd rather have. But there could also be a super. My other idea is just to have another two D Mario Maker game, but with one game style that was three D. It would be and it would be like Super Mario three uh, D World where it would be very linear, very an open world, like place block by block, place thing by thing. It wouldn't be like a giant, massive kingdom. It would be just a linear 3D level, like that would be in the style of 3D world. And along with that one extra game mode, there would be new, like there would be also 2D stuff. So you, in the 2D, you'd have the four original game styles, then you'd have like maybe three more like, or uh, th 3D World 2, you'd have like maybe Super Mario Land, Odyssey, or Galaxy could come in as their own game styles, and it would be like Super Mario Maker 3, and it, it would be 2D, but there'd also be a 3D mode. I, I just really want to make a 3D Mario game, and the way I want it is very hard, and I don't want to put Nintendo through that, so I think it would just be better if they uh, did it as like, 3D world, like make your own little linear level, and then you can also still make 2D levels with a bunch of new items, like a bunch of new power-ups, game styles, bosses, I, 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 and I love Mario Maker, so I'd really like to see that. But, uh, so, my number three is a 3D Mario spin-off starring one of Mario's other characters. Now, I'm not talking about, like, Luigi's Mansion or Captain Toad, those were, like, puzzle games. I'm talking about a 3D platformer starring one of Mario's, like, spin-off characters. Like a Yoshi game. A 3D Yoshi game. We haven't had a 3D Yoshi game. We haven't. We have not, which is insane. I mean, oh, sorry. Yoshi Safari, the Mario first-person shooter where you shot Koopas. Yeah, we've had that one. But we haven't had a platformer starring Yoshi that was 3D, and I think that is a missed opportunity, and we need it. It would also... We still also still haven't had a 3D platformer to star. Luigi. Luigi, I think, also needs a 3D platformer. I think that would be fantastic. I, it would be, and it would be the most similar to a Mario game, just starring Luigi. Maybe with the Poltergeist, too. It could be, like, a platformer where the Poltergeist was, like, a grap, where you could, like, grapple onto ghosts, or, like, where you could, like, Maybe it could still be like a Luigi's Mansion game where the main thing would be ghosts and like sucking up ghosts. But it would also like be a platformer and in a big open world. I think Luigi deserves a game or just call it Super Luigi 64 and make it very similar to Mario 64 but with better graphics and starring Luigi. I think that would be right since Luigi was snuffed out of that game. And then the other option is Donkey Kong. Make a 3D Donkey Kong game. They have. Gratefully, they haven't made a Yoshi one and they haven't made a Luigi one. But at least they have made a Donkey Kong one. And it was a pretty good game. I actually haven't played it. But apparently it's a good game. I just want another one. Maybe a more linear one. Or maybe a more open world one. But, like, just a new 3D Mario game. I do really want to play Donkey Kong 64. But I'd have to have a working 64. I have a 64 with my mom's. And it doesn't have color anymore or sound, I don't think. And it's pretty, it's pretty, like, old and bad. So, what I really hope they do, Nintendo, is, like, add Super Mario 64 games to Nintendo Switch Online, maybe in the next console. But I doubt that will ever. No, I doubt that, I, I think it'll happen, but I doubt it'll happen on our current system. But yeah, so, please, just give me a platformer starring either Yoshi, Donkey Kong, and Luigi and make it 3D. I, the one I want most is a Luigi game, but I think the other two would be great as well. And maybe a Donkey Kong game. I mean, not Donkey Kong, maybe a Toad game, but he has Captain Toad. I, I, that's good enough for me. Captain Toad's amazing. I do kind of also want like an Indiana Jones style, like Dark Souls, like sword fighting, like cave exploring game where you play as Captain Toad. I think that would be really fun. But I, I see that less likely. I think the most likely one is either a Luigi or a Yoshi. I, I, I think uh, it's likely we get a 3D Donkey Kong game, but not as likely as Luigi. Uh, so yeah. But my uh, number two is a sequel to the greatest Mario game. And yes, this is where I crown. I have now played Odyssey. I have now played Mario Galaxy. Which one 
do I think is the best Mario game. 3D World, I think, I'm kidding. I love 3D World, it's my favorite, but it's not the best. I think the best is Odyssey. Odyssey is a masterpiece. It's absolutely incredible. And it needs a sequel. I think we could get one by the end of this year. Like, not that we could get one, we're definitely gonna get one. But I think it even could happen by the end of this year. I think it might be this year's big Nintendo Christmas game. Don't hold me on to that, but that's my little prediction. But yeah, we need a sequel to Mario Odyssey. And Galaxy. My number two is a sequel to Mario Odyssey and Galaxy, because I want them both equally. Well, I want Mario Odyssey more, I want also want Galaxy a lot too, because I, I, think, I think I want it more, even though Odyssey will be better. And I like Odyssey more, and I think I'll like the game better. I want Galaxy more. Just so we can have, finally, a Mario trilogy. We've never had a 3D Mario trilogy. 64, Sunshine, and Odyssey are kind of a trilogy, but they all play so differently just by having the same, like, basics. So, I think uh, we need a Mario Galaxy 3, and we need one now. Or not now, I don't think it'll happen ever. But I really, really want one. But I think Mario Odyssey is more likely... Even though I want it less, I think I'd like it more, because I like Odyssey more than I like Galaxy. So, both, I'm sure, would be masterpieces, because both their originals are masterpieces. So, that's it. But my number one is probably the least likely out of all of these. While all of these have been rooted in some sort of basis, this one's not. This is my own idea for a Mario game. And it would be called Super Mario Mansion. So, in this game, uh, I, I've like made a whole story for it, bullet boarded it, everything. I, I know what this game would be like. I have a picture of it in my head. Bowser's Kingdom invades a kingdom of giants and over and like infests their houses like little tiny mice, and gets the giants to move out. And then Mario has to. And like Mario and Peach and their kingdom, Mushroom Kingdom is like an ally with the Giants Kingdom or whatever. So they have to help the Giants. So Mario and all their people go in, since they're the same size, and try to fight with Mario. But Mario learns that there's a secret underbelly, like rebellion, going against Bowser, who they used to be going against the Giants. Like these little gremlin creatures, kind of like rats but like gremlins and for specific rooms that like war with each other but like want freedom from the giants but the giants just look at them as like pests like just little like little bugs but the the like pests want freedom and they want to be like treated equally with the giants so they've been planning this war and they were ready to fight against the giants but then the giants get kicked out and bowser comes in who like ravishes them and now Bowser is the ruler and now they're having to slowly build up their army and Mario helps them and like connects with them and has to like find like the lead gremlin from each room to like help lead the army to fight Bowser and like every single room would be like a kingdom of Odyssey where you'd have to like get a certain amount of star keys to get to the next room and you would like, there would be like adventures where you would like have to like climb through drawers or drawers could be like pocket dimensions to different levels. Or you would have to climb up shelves, there's a shelf right there, you don't see it. Like to like climb up shelves and then fight bosses or organize books or like hide in closets and like, uh, and like, or go through like the sewers to get to the like different rooms or fight a monster in the sink. Uh, or, like, unclog the sink to unleash a boss fight in the kitchen. Beat the boss fight, you get a star key. Something like that is, like, a dream for me. I love Toy Story. So I love the idea of being little in a big house, like, as a video game. And I think that game would be incredible. So, uh, yeah. E and each, like, room would have their own little gremlins. So, like, there would be bedroom gremlins. I, I actually film in my bedroom. There would be, in this room, there would be bedroom gremlins. Then in, uh, like, the kitchen, there'd be kitchen gremlins who love to cook. In bathroom gremlins, there'd be, like, dirty bathroom gremlins who, like, are, like, icky. And then, and there would be, like, and the bed, like, the living room would be the biggest kingdom. Actually, no, the kitchen would be the biggest kingdom. But the bedroom would be, I mean, living room would be, like, the one, maybe, or, like, they all rally to fight. Or, actually, no, the bedroom would, like, Bowser would, like, take over the 
bedroom because it's like, it'd be, like the master bedroom would be like the biggest like fight like at the very end but yeah I'm sorry I just went on a whole rant because I want this game to happen so much and I don't think it ever will it never will unless I somehow become a game dev for Nintendo, which I don't want to be. I want to be a politician, as you can see. Braden 2020, I mean, Braden 2044, the pursuit of happiness. Uh, Braden for president. Anyways, I really want the game to happen. But it won't, but I think some elements of it might in a Mario Odyssey 2 sequel. I think there could be a big house kingdom in Mario Odyssey 2. If I could pick which room, because I doubt they'd make a whole house, because that would be too big, uh, and it, it, like, and you'd be small, uh, I think I'd want them to do, like, a kitchen kingdom. That would be a little too similar to the luncheon kingdom match. No, I don't think it would. I, I want a kitchen kingdom, or a bedroom kingdom. Kitchen or bedroom, or, or bathroom. Not really a living room, because I feel like that's a little too generic. But yeah, I just want, or I'd be fine with living room, though. I just want a room where you play in as a kingdom in Mario Odyssey. But I'd prefer it to have its own, like, game where each, like, room was its own kingdom that you had to run through and explore, similar to Odyssey. But yeah, I really want the game to happen. But it won't. It won't. I'm not going to ever get my hopes up because it's purely theoretical. But yeah, I hope you enjoy Mario season. We have more videos coming soon. Good night. Good morning and play Super Mario Odyssey because it's such a freaking masterpiece, you guys.